right, I am being given the go ahead here. So without any further ado, I'd like to welcome Ori and uh, I would like to welcome Ori and get this started for Sonic Robo Blast 2. Take it away. All right, thank you very much. So hello everyone. So this is a game called Sonic Robo Blast 2 and I'm Boris Guy and I'm going to be doing the Any% Sonic uh, run for this game or also known as Beaver Game. Uh, if you like, but I'm going to be going just to the end of, I think, Black Rock 3 and defeating the final boss in that zone. So before we get started, I'd just like to introduce, um, would you like to introduce yourself, uh, my lovely commentator with me today? Hello, I am Argig. I am here to help commentate this run for Ori while we go through, have some fun and have a good time. Thank you. All right, so before we get started, I'm just going to quickly jump because uh, in case you're not familiar with this game, I'm just going to jump into a quick demo here just to show you the very first uh, like one of the mechanics that is unique to this game. So this is a 3D Sonic game built in the Doom Legacy engine and it's been in development since 1998 and it's a fan game as well. Um, so it's a very long development cycle and it's still in development too, which is, you know, absolutely phenomenal. And it is a very fun game to play as well. Um, it's also free, so please check it out after this if you'd like to. But the one thing to introduce here is just, this will be going very fast. So we have a unique mechanic called the Thark, which is like this. Uh, it just allows Sonic to go fast forward. It's kind of like a homing attack, but not really. It just kind of sends you forward fast. So that's really the only thing I had to explain there. Um, I won't spoil anything in my other run, but without further ado, I think we will be ready to get started here. So let me go ahead and this game does have a built-in marathon run mode as well, which is really nice. Uh, we can delete this, that's fine. <laughs> um, all right, so this also has live event backup, which just means it's different to standard in that we have a glimpse that continues in case of a marathon death uh, in game over. And if the game for the unlikely event does crash, we can restart the game and just get back where we were again. So I think we're ready to go. So let's go ahead and go for in three, two, one, go. So right after that, I'm going to immediately get a grab a ring first. Immediately jump over the waterfall and I'm going to miss that entirely. Whoops. <laughs> So what I'm trying to do there is get a bit of momentum from the slope and then jump straight into the uh, waterfall there and get up. But we missed the jump, but that's fine. So as you can see, we've got the speed shoes just filling right through this level. So slopes, jumping off slopes does give you more momentum, as you can see here. I'm going to bounce off this enemy, hopefully. There we go. And managing to get right to the end there. Not uh, too bad of a time there, to be honest. Very nice. Getting those slope bounces and that, that's very hard. It's harder than it looks, really. And you're going to see Ori do this throughout the run. It's going to be quite fun. And uh, we're going to go grab the most overpowered shield in the game. This is the Whirlwind Shield. This gives Sonic a little mini double jump here. It's not the same height as a full jump, so you're going to be careful with when you actually use it, but it is absolutely invaluable. And you're going to see Ori just make light work of this entire stage here by just going up and over the wall here conserving momentum Ooh. from the springs making sure you dodge the spikes there well played and uh, gonna go down yeah gonna go down into our waterfall area here we're gonna see if we can make a cycle oh. it looks like just gonna miss it Gosh, so not yeah. quite making the speedy cycle there uh, so we're almost at the end of the stage here this is actually kind of a side route there's another route which is almost as fast if you do it optimally but we take this route just because of the ideal we get the cycle there and manage to get roughly like a 35 seconds which is pretty good for that uh Act anyway, but that was okay. Definitely. And then, of course, just like classic Sonic games here, once you've got three stages, just like Sonic 1, oh. third stage is a boss stage. This boss has laser beams. It's going to move, it's going to fire a laser, it's going to move, it's going to fire a laser. Once you get about five hits on it, the boss is going to start smoking, going into desperation phase, meaning the boss is going to speed up and fire triple lasers here. And you're going to be very careful not to take the damage. Oh. Grab the ring for safety. Nice, safe the ring there. Yep. Get the boss, and away we go. And you're going to stand on the giant egg. <laughs> it is. It's an egg. Like, I know it's the top of a capsule, but it's an egg. I also, I have to apologize to everyone who's got dark mode on right now. <laughs> that is Sorry. very bright, yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, off All right. into Techno Hell here. Techno Hell is a super fast stage. You're going to see really cool features coming through. Or you're going to grab the speed shoes there. Oh, and then you're going to use... Oh, well. got the enemy bounce. Very nice. I'm happy with that. So, so you're meant to be on the route here as well. Mm -hmm. So go ahead. No, no, just fine. As, as you say, just go through. You're going to take the top route here. I'm going to try and use the enemies to bounce off their heads, sorry, off their backs. Because those enemies have springs on them. You can bounce off them, and you want to try and carry the speed shoes as far as you can. Unfortunately, speed shoes running out, so we're going to do a double thug off the edge. A big old uh, jump, trying to dodge it. Taking the backup fine. route. Smart move. 
Uh, not having enough speed there means you don't want to fall down into the purple blip. You'll find out why when we get to stage two. And Ori's going oh, for this quack oh. strats here. Okay, here we I go. Tried. Extra set of two shoes. I tried to give a bounce off the um, like the, the flying enemy as well, but I couldn't get that. Yeah, no, you, you, again, momentum and uh, just like... Can, basically, you convert, convert your height from jumping into big bounces and things like that. You convert your men momentum. And it works both horizontally and vertically. Unfortunately, Ori not getting a big enough bounce off the item box meant that that didn't translate over to the enemy bounce. So instead of getting over the giant hole there with the purple gloop in it, you had to go around the other way. But uh, in it, Techno no. Hill 2 now. Fine. I tried to go for the, the silly thing where I just did the pop-up, but we didn't get it. Mm-hmm. But now you can see the purple gloop on the stage here. The purple gloop is basically a giant jello slide. Um, the plan is, the further you jump into it, here's a skip. Ooh, we got time. That's fine, you've got speed juice. We got time, do it again. Converse, jump there up, and go. then there you go. Second time. Very That's nice, very smooth. It's really hard to make that jump. You have to do it at the right kind of timing. Oh, I nearly fell as well. <laughs> please don't, please don't fall. Not gonna I'll run try. through. Are you going for it? You are, um, you're going for the exercise speed juice. Speed juice. juice. Yeah, we're going to first person mode, because this is built in the new engine. I'm just gonna yep. run right through these corridors. Oh no, bounce on the wall. Very but smooth, bro. Going to bounce off this enemy, hopefully. There we go. Nice. And then right up the slope. And dropping right down here to get a windshield again. Secret sure windshield. Get. And now we're coming to the most cycle based part of the stage here. Gonna be very oh, yeah. careful because again, you've got the flubber. Flubber, the higher you are in the flubber, when you land in it, the further yeah. down you will go. It wastes a lot mm -hmm. of time. We're gonna skip part of it by jumping oh, I'm, from I'm... this piston. You got this, this you got this. There you go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> First and try. Skip over the big chunk of the level there, because normally oh, you no. go around the square, you don't need to do any of that, because instead you just jump with the shield over the piston, straight over the wall, and up to these moving platform cycles. Unfortunately, cycles are slightly off, so we do have to wait our way through it, but we're good to go. Yeah. Good falling there and going round is not fun. I've done it a few times. Uh, I think you've seen a few as well, and it's not fun at all. Oh, definitely. It's not... These stages, they are massive, and there are lots of things that can go horribly wrong in them. Uh, but when you're trying to speedrun it, and you're doing the same thing over and over and over again, the slightest <laughs> action will change your cycles, and it's just like... <sighs> yeah, that should be fifth hit. Nice. So, desperation phase here. So, we're bottom is playing Splatoon 2 over here with us, but we don't want any of that. We just want to kill him, and we're fine. <laughs> are you a squid, or are you a kid? Yes, is my answer to that <laughs> <one>. <laughs> The non-answer. All right. Well, that's, that's from a non from a non-answer with Splatoon, we got to get rid of all that pain. What's the best way to do it than with some water here? So we're gonna head into deep sea zone, and you're gonna see some absolutely fantastic play here from Ori. Gonna oh, jump over right. on that, went down onto the oh, item box, and woo! Okay. I'm happy. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Thank you. I am. There's what we're talking about that. with the momentum. Ah, uh, because. You basically carry momentum like vertically when you hit an item box. If you hold jump, you carry more momentum and get super boost. Oh, I'm not making that. No. So you just go right back up again. And especially in water, it works very well. Uh, please. This nice, nice. No, no, good recovery. Nice. Yeah. Good recovery. <laughs> that waterfall is a pain in the butt. It is constantly fighting you the moment you touch it, trying to push you down. Ori, though, making very nice work of it. Going to finish the stage here with a five-tap rev on the spin dash. Away we go, over and in, and sorted. I wonder what's up there. Not a clue. I'll have to find out oh. later. I guess, I, okay, I guess we'll find out now. <laughs> in Ice 2. Ta-da! <laughs> what's up here? Giant water slide. Yeah, this stage has a few. I forgot how many now. It's one or two. Uh, we're going to do a big seven-tap, well, seven-hold spin here and then try and jump immediately as you land to keep momentum. Not quite. So the longer you stay on the ground after landing, the kind of more friction affects you. So you want to jump to try and get the biggest boost after doing a thuck. You want to get the biggest, like, like that. Just jumping as soon as you land. You want to try and do that to get to kind of keep momentum. And I'm going to do, hopefully a jump. Oh, OK, missing the cycle. But I'm probably going to miss the next cycle as well. Oh, no, we got it. Okay. Okay, this is a scary section. I want to not rush this. Yeah, you gotta be very careful here. You're, again, Deep Sea 2 is very cycle heavy. Uh, the most important thing is when you're on this area, don't get cursed by the ceiling. Ceiling can go squish. Yeah. 
If you run into the ceiling too fast as it's coming up as well, you can get squished as well. I've had that happen to me a few times. It's not fun. <laughs> Let's do the seven spin tap here. Uh, close enough. So you see me put, uh, kind of, whenever I land from a thought, sometimes I'm spinning. That's just to preserve momentum because you actually lose it more slowly from friction if you're spinning uh, rather than, you know, running. But we do have a final water slide here. I'm going to try and stay in the air as long as possible here and just do be like going way fast forward because the water slide itself is quite slow. So you see me jumping and docking immediately as soon as I can get like a straight uh, area to go down. And straight down the ceilings. You didn't used to be able to do that on the ceiling, by the way. That was a, an update in the latest version, I think, the latest patch. Because um, you used to just bonk up the ceiling, but now you can slide down those just like you can slide up the slopes as well. Um, but I am going to go for a very early hit on the boss here by immediately mashing my mouse. There we nice. go. Nice. And I'm looking for the shadow here. Okay. Yeah. Straight through good. there. So yeah, th uh, this boss, very simple. Fires EMP, then fires lasers. The one that fires the EMP is the one that's real. You ancient one that's real. Well, because when the boss goes into the desperation phase here, it's going to pop up two clones. Surprise! And then Aura's going to try and get the hits here. Trying to uh, look for the shadow to find out where the boss is to get the quickest possible hit. But the boss is giving a random there pattern there. The 26 is still very nice. Hmm. It looks like I went through the EMP then. That was weird. I guess we I shall not question it. <laughs> All right, now we're on to, I think, Argic's favorite zone here. Would you like to introduce the name of this zone? Yo, it's Castle <laughs> Yeatman. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do a big... Sp oh! Okay, Good recovery. Okay. Good recovery. <laughs> And we're going to use these, as I call them, yeeting devices. So just throw us right up here. I don't know what these are actually called. Slingshots, I guess. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. We're just going to use these to get... This is not the intended route, I don't think. But we can just use this to skip a lot of that first section here. Then we're going to jump right off the monitor box here. Using the, like, holding down jump again. No, oh, no. Uh, this is fine. fine. I'm not going to go for the, the try. I'm not going to try the skip here. I'm just going to go the normal route. I yeah. Think. I'm too scared. No, nope, that's it's fine. Like th this is the best thing about this game is these levels are massive. We know our backup routes when we need them. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, they are just what happened. Was trying to get that item bounce. You, it's very hard to judge where you actually are with Sonic unless you can see the shadow. When you're launching yourself off the eating devices, you can't really see your shadow. So you just got to get yeah. a feel for it. And it obviously, marathon nerfs are a thing too. So you're just sitting there going, "Don't mess it up! Don't mess it up! Don't mess it up!" Yeah, speaking of messing up, this is, uh, like, what do you call it? Uh, Dark, uh, Darkling Shrine? Firelink Shrine, sorry, from Dark Souls right here. But we're not going to stay there, we're going to go on to Eggman's Castle. Did you link the fire? No, I just, I, 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 if I die here, no, it should be fine. <laughs> no, don't die here, you'll be fine. Oh, why am I, okay. I'm not going to okay, going, going, going for the mini skip there, just getting out the cave, because the walls fall down before the gate there, onto the bridge collapse, running our oh. way through here, making sure you don't get a bit of spikes, and nailed it. Yeah, you can you can do like a seven tap spin dash to get off the side there, it's a bit faster, but I don't like to do that, it's very scary. I just do a thork around the side, and I just do an air strafe. But this is probably my fa one of my favourite zones of the game here, I think. Indeed, Castle Eggman 2 is a lot of fun. Again, another cycle based stage here. We've got these platforms that are moving. You've got constant things that are swinging around, trying to hit you on the ball and chain there. Another set coming in here. Or we're going to sneak right through there, snaking their way through. As we're going to see, run, jump, big bounce here. Going to wait off the item box there. Nails it, goes around over the fence there, down at the bottom section, into the nice. middle. Going to go for another set of jumps at this checkpoint here. Opting not to go for the second beta of speed juice. Going to carry this set of speed juice all the way up. Jumping off the side there, very smooth. Oh. Round past the enemies, onto the side, round to the spring, onto the <laughs> ramp while the speed juice are still there, oh. and bam, ten, ten. nails that section. Well time, played. So. Hmm. Uh, I used to go for the other speed juice, but now that I've got that section down, I usually skip them because I kind of, not, I'm not, like, you, if you get the other side, you can kind of skip that entire gap there, but I'm not good at that jump. It's quite precise, so I just skip those. But we are going to go ahead and get close to the end of the stage here. I'm going to jump through a set of spikes in a moment here. Hopefully. That was fantastic. Nice. Getting through that in one section was really nice. Thank so you. coming through to the end, to the library of Minecraft. It is totally Minecraft library. <laughs> Nobody can tell me otherwise. It, it We're going to go is. up the top. Oh, okay. You, you, you just wait for the sense. villagers to come around now. Just... Oh. <laughs> well played. And a little review of a book. 
the red book, which is yes. actually really important because coming up next is the boss, oh, which no. is all memory, no random whatsoever. The buttons are in order. Going to be red, donk the boss. Red, blue, donk the boss. Sorry, blue, yellow, donk the boss. See, I've yeah, already messed yellow. it up. My memory's rubbish. <laughs> My memory's oh, yeah. gone. Uh, oh, now it's I, red. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, uh, red, I yellow. It, can, it goes back to red after all, after the second time, every time it goes back to red. Yeah, because now it's red, blue, then it's red, oh, blue, yellow. Oh no! Oh, no. Yeah, right. hit the boss. Yeah, grab yeah, a ring, yeah, grab yeah. a ring, grab a ring. <laughs> okay, oh no! That's fine, okay. that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, okay, now we've got red, blue, yellow. Yes. And then you will activate desperation phase. I got one ring, that's all I need. <laughs> one ring and roll them all. Just don't go near the foam fingers, please. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've hit those a few times after bouncing off them a few times, so, oh no, like oh, that. Oh, like that, yeah, like that, yeah. that's fine. It doesn't, doesn't normally happen, so I'm wondering what's changed. Ah, <laughs> uh, this should be fine. Right, one, one more hit to go, and there smooth. Go. Good job. Oh. Hey, hey, one for nice. the road. <laughs> Home run right. all the way down. I am going to struggle to explain what's going on in this next act. Do you want to cover this while I... I will cover you. Yes, I have you up. covered. Welcome to Ori Canyon. <laughs> Meant to be Arid Canyon, but this is Ori Canyon because Ori and I have spent a lot of time just having fun on this stage. And uh, every time we were playing it, Ori would come up with a new strategy. Oh. Yes, you just saw Ori skip like a massive chunk of the stage here. <laughs> Using the tornadoes in this stage, they can serve and transfer your momentum into horizontal momentum with a lovely launch there. So we're going to see more of that in a second. But first, we're going to grab the World Windshield. We're going to jump down from the Great Height onto the enemy's head here. We're going to do another oh jump with the World Windshield, just making it up to the top right. We're going to land scary. up onto the top of the canyon here. Big jump down. We're going to line up. We're going to land on the speed shoes. Come out of Doom mode so we can go around the side of the canyon here. Carry the speed on the speed oh. shoes. Big old jump. <gasps> okay, this. No! Down oh. the bottom. That's going to be a retry. Okay. Going to be a retry. So. Here. Yeah, back at it, but we get to see the stage a second time. So once again, we're gonna go all the way through. We're gonna grab the whirlwind shield, get the jump off the enemy, all the way up to the top. No, we're falling down again. Oh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Back up strap, nice. We're just showing off more of the stage here, it's fine. Of course. <laughs> we'll bounce off our enemy. Big bounce okay. up. This jump, get the jump. scares me. Okay. Oh, nailed it. That scares me so much, it's so close. That's fine, you got this. So we're going to go around, try it a second time, we're going to line it up with Doom Mode, come out of Doom Mode the moment you hit it, carry the momentum around, going to get an earlier jump, want to make sure you don't hit the cacti, that's an arc thing, as we go through, <laughs> jump through into the tornado, carry the momentum around, launching our way through, and believe it or not, the stage is almost completed, we've got one more thing yeah. we need to do, we're going to jump onto the pillar here, do a big full 7 charge, jump into the double jump, run to the spring, you've got the wall, oh, oh you've got the wall, back up strat. Yeah, there's a backup shield we can get back here. I'm going to grab. Oh, hopefully. so That's big backup strat. Yeah. This, uh, so believe it or not, this is faster than doing the alternative, like the, the, the intended it's, strat, I guess. It's still <laughs> faster doing the stage. The intended strat, like you wouldn't even be at this part of the stage if you were doing the stage normally right now. Run through the canyon, big there jump. There you go, off the spring to the end, dodge the enemy. Here comes the flyer, nailed it. Yeah, so grab here and immediately up and we're done. Good job. Okay. Un unlucky on clipping the wall there. Clipping the wall just yeah. cost you that little bit of speed that you needed. Uh -huh. You have to do the windshield there before you get around the corner, so it's, it's always scary doing it blind. But we are going to grab another windshield right here. Woohoo! Best shield in the game. This, this shield is nice. Like, I didn't realize it was here for a long time, and then I suddenly found it, and it's like, oh wait, this will help. <laughs> so yeah, we actually do this. And straight over the gap. Uh, Very nice. So we're going to try and do me do jump. There we go. Oh, you're going for that one. All right, here we go. Yeah. Now Ori has to really control their momentum there because those can't, those those tornadoes will just eat you uh, the wrong direction if you're not controlling them. But Ori, oh. hey, mm, almost, no, almost no, on no, the TNT. Now we got a strike. <laughs> Oh, this is my favorite section of the game. Said nobody, but I mean, I want well. <laughs> <laughs> All I right. This here, though. Oh, you're going for it? All right, I'll explain it. I'll uh, show you once. So coming up here, you can see we're on the minecart. The minecart section is very annoying because you can only get off at the designated start and end point. If you get knocked off the rail at any other point in time, you are dead. The game will just kill you. 
Um, so what Ori is going to try and do here is instead of going inside the mine here and go all the way around it, as you can see, there's lots of things in the mine here. We're going to just about turn and we're going to do a giant jump over the canyon. Uh, we're going to see how this turns out. Ori has a couple of frame window here to try and plan the jump and let's see if they can do it. Mm, Too late. Nice. No. Okay, yeah. we'll, we'll, I won't do it again. No, it one, and, one and done. One and done is always yeah. safe on this one. <laughs> We also only have two items left anyway, so I wanted to conserve those a bit. Smart move. If we game over, then we do get a continue, and as I mentioned, this is why we went back up, so we'll get infinite continues. But the game over does send you back to the start of the act you're on, so it doesn't matter if you've got checkpoints or anything, you just get sent back. So not a good time was if that does happen, especially because we're getting into the later levels of the game here. Um, we do not want that to happen on one of the stages that's coming up. Speaking of which, uh, uh, we will be. Uh. We, uh, uh, I for some reason I oh please frame drops. Oh dear, that's fine. It's not a good time. Uh, we will be. So I did decide for some reason it'd be a good idea to submit an incentive to do the the worst possible loots on Egg Rock One and Two. So we'll be doing that because that was met way before the run even started. <laughs> because people would like to see me suffer, I guess. <laughs> Indeed, that'll be fun. May I take over for this one? Yes, please, please do. <laughs> All right, welcome to Arrow Canyon 3, the worst boss in the game. It is Fang the Weasel. Ori here is going to try and catch Fang as quickly as they can because what you want to do is every time Fang bounces on the ground, he becomes vulnerable again. Ooh, a little bit too early on the thock there. So Fang's going to fire his cork cannon at us here. And now he's going to jump over to the middle after this final hit here and go into yeah. the final phase. So these walls that we love, they're gone. Oh, if we nice. accidentally yeet on the boss, we're going to be in trouble. There's two hits left on the boss here. He's going to drop the bombs down. We need to dodge the bombs while we try and get a hit on him as well. He is jumping around mad right now, being very, very uh, uh, annoying. He's up the top. You don't want to go for that. You don't yeah. want to go for that. No. I do. No. Oh, yes, oh, I do. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Play me dangerously. Oh, dear. That is scary. Can you go up you the top, too, please? Like, so the top. <laughs> he's being a bud, he's staying up the top there. So the three tiers, the very bottom, the middle, yeah. and then the top. You do not wish to thock him on the top, because if you thock him on the top, the recoil will send you off the edge of the train there. But, whoa, that's a stage. <laughs> that is a stage. Oh, but it's... Yeah. Sub minute, though. Sub minute, though. Good stuff. I'm, I'm just glad I didn't die. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Sub minute. GG's. Yeah, all right, welcome you. to Red Volcano time. Everything is fine because we're going to come through here and Ori is going to dodge all the lava, all the fire, all the plumes and go on the cheese bridges around the level here. And we're going to go all the... Oh, it no. looks like cheese, okay? There's holes okay. in it. It's like cream. Right. It's tea. <laughs> <laughs> wait, did I, wait, did I hear cream and cheese in a Sonic game? What? Again? <laughs> all right. So we are going to see Ori run right around the edge here on the outside where the Red Volcano is. The only stage in the game that has one eye. Going to dodge the birds because when the birds try and get you, you're going to be in trouble. See if Ori is going to go and grab the windshield. It looks like they are. There yeah. they go. Wonderful windshield. We love it. Don't get caught by the birds. Going to bounce on the other bird down here, though. Going to launch us all the way up to the top onto the spring, landing on the second platform before the top there. No, opting for the full bounce all the way. Very nice. Yeah, I make sure to stop there because uh, I won't make that. I don't think. Let's just use this, I guess. So we're going to take deliberate damage here. We're going to skip the orbs. You're supposed to use one of the orbs uh, that Eggman normally swings around on his Sonic 1 boss to run across the lava here. But we're going to skip that, grabbing another shield here. This is a magnet shield. Unfortunately, we're only using it for a damage boost to protect our ranks as we run our way through the rest of the stage. And now okay. we get to our favorite part. Or at least my favorite part. This is where we get some really precise platforming and it just looks absolutely amazing. Down the lava pole there. Down we go. Smooth jumps all the way through. Nice direction in here. Here comes the giant firewall. We're going to get in. Ori has the right antivirus, though, so we're going to make it right through. Very good skill. Run the other side down the third one. Here we go. And then on to wonky lava. No work, eh? Because we're going to run through here. And the lava sometimes doesn't work. So we got to have fun with it. Although you're about to go and get dropped on it. So wonky lava does decide to work. Going to, however, use the jump. You're fine. Oh. I got messed up by a bird there. I just got ruined. Yeah, the birds are, uh, they, they are jerk birds. Uh, but there's one kill lava. Uh, Takes one damage, we just run over the top of it. And, no, just jump, just jump, just jump. You're fine, just jump. Okay, we're fine. There you go. <laughs> like I say, one kill lava, no work. <laughs> so yeah. you're fine. It's very oh. hard to, uh, some, sometimes the lava is just very hard to jump on. And I was like, mashing my mouse button there, I just would not jump for ages. Yeah, it does, <laughs> it eats your jump. All right, Ori, I'm sorry. Um, I guess we're going this way, I guess. This is on you. Uh, 
<laughs> I've learned some speed strats here. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, I'm just nice. barely. Nice. Okay. Good clip. There. Yeah. Doesn't uh, get crushed. Cam is going wonky right now. We're going to take this slowly because this is not a fun route. Uh, we're going yep. to flip gravity in a second here. There we go. We're going to wait a bit because we're actually on the floor right now, believe it or not. We're going to wait and now we're on the ceiling again. Now we're on the ceiling again still. Wait, we need to... Okay, this is actually fine. Hold on. Um, I was confused hey. for a second. There we go. Oh, so, I do not like part. For, for those got, of you... I got a skip. Watch this. We can oh. hit this. this and then just run through it. it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I Damage I just boosted. <laughs> Beautiful. I still can't believe you decided to take this route in a run. Like, oh. I, I you are not I, supposed to. Everyone else did. It's not my well, fault. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're the one that put the incentive in, so you're you're getting the blame here. That's that's entirely reasonable. Oh, we missed that. We can't make that jump. So we have to do this. Oh, those are very scary because you get crushed if you stay them too long. We also have an airlock here, which is going to drain all the air, so we need to get up here fast enough without falling, ideally. Uh, which is actually apparently hard for me. Please, <laughs> there we go. Uh, oh, this is my. Least favorite section. <laughs> uh, jump down here. Thankfully, made that. We're going to wait for the cycle, actually. That jump is quite precise. You have to air strafe and also get like a, a good uh, stock jump as well. Uh, I'm going to wait for this platform. Whoa! I didn't know you were there. <laughs> Sniped by the lovely little snail on the edge there. Got to spin dash yeah. under that or you get pushed. Got to wait for the other platform to come in while jumping through the laser wall that's going to kill you. You can see why we don't do this route in the speed run. What? This route's long. Okay. This row sucks. Oh, oh, You're not I fine. Nope. I thought I. Nah. This is what it. Uh, uh, this, is, this is good about as well as expected right now. We need to grab everything just in case. Yeah, we have one life left. So we're going to get the thog jump around there. Well done. Waiting on the cycle for the stairs again to come round. For info, this stage is done in like a minute and 10 seconds if you take the other route. Yep. <laughs> this is. Where's the plant from Medica? <laughs> right, oh no. no, no, no. Oh, that's okay. a spin dash. Oh, okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah, that can happen if you're not moving as well. Because this counts you as being on a static like, place, I guess. I would say this slowly this time. Not, not too slowly, so because um, there's a reason why that's red and black. There's a thing that's going to squish you. Yeah. You can't stay on oh. that too long. And the game okay. giving us the lovely 2D movement. Here we go. Hey. Spin dash immediately. There we go. Lovely. And this next section is still scary, I think. Uh, actually, this is okay, I think. Yeah, we'll firewall is generally all right. I have some fast traps for this, but it's actually too risky, so I decided not to. Oh, you have one life to go. I want to, uh, I want to <laughs> get a life. I did not turn out as expected. No, I'm not going for it. I'm, if I try and get a life, I'll just die. And do the opposite. Alright, we're almost at the end of the stage anyway. Out in this space where Sonic cannot breathe, but we're going to do the big bounces to the end of the stage there. Three minutes and <sighs> one second for Egg Rock 1. <laughs> wow. I'm, I, I'm not happy right now. <laughs> oh, I bet. I bet. I'm about to be even less happy. Yeah, because now you're doing Egg Rock 2, and this is That's a completely different route. Have fun. Yeah, I'm going to the left side first, which is already slow. And I'm going to the left side after this part as well. So we're going to take these fans. Try not to fall here because this is a death pit, I think. Yes, it is. Uh, Big fan. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't fall off the edge there. Like, if you hit that wall, you're not under the fan now. And now, uh, uh, Ori, right, nice knowing you. Have fun. Why you're taking this route, I don't know. I, so we're out in I, space. I, We've got time. Something 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 charity indeed right firewall let's go firewall done now we've got more platforms that are going to have crushers and that on you we've got enemies flying around we've got walls that are going to crush you we've got more anti-gravity shenanigans no. and down in the hole so we gotta take a continue yep this is fine so as you say i've got two skips coming up here that i actually found yesterday as well uh you'll like them but oh i oh I'm, I'm looking forward to it if you can get there in time though so we have to go left again because we decided to do this for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> uh, we can actually skip one of these fans, but I don't want to do it because it's risky. <laughs> oh, oh, we're fine. Okay, going left again. 
Uh, hands in the chat point, thank you. <laughs> they have tiny hitboxes. Uh, yeah, some of them have bigger than others, but that one, that one itself is... Is it a buzzing? Can I get... Can I get... Please. <laughs> 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 Calm the strength of Uma here. So we can jump here. Skip one. That was a bit risky. I don't have enough speed for that, so I had to fuck. But we're fine. I'm going to take this very slow. Just fall down, thank you. I'm going to take this and then immediately jump over here. And this is boom here is where I've actually got two skips. Normally you have to, I don't know if you've done this one before, Agic, but we have to normally do like a back and forth of changing gravity and stuff. But we can do this. Nice. And then skipping this section as well, we can actually take the gravity back and grab this invincibility. And we can actually, this bit you're Just run through the wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love laser walls. I love the laser walls. It's like, yo, I'm a laser wall. You can't go through here. I'm invincible. Yes, I can. <laughs> oh. All right, so gravity's going to flip. I need to listen carefully here, actually. Five. I need to listen carefully for this bit here in particular. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. All right, now I'm good, I think. Actually, wait, 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 wait. Okay, we're good. Now we're good. So that section is scary because if you fall there, you obviously die and you get sent back quite a bit. Um, so we just need to line ourselves up. We've got one more gravity flip after this one. So two, actually, including this one. Um, but then we will be in, I think, a 2D section after this. Which is actually still a bit scary, but we should be fine, I think. These stages are massive. Like, you you don't see this part of the stage at all, by the way, in the game. No. And, and when, you, when you're doing an any percent speedrun route in this one, and don't have an Ori-style incentive, you don't see <laughs> any of this. This is brand new. This is fine, this is fine, this is fine. Okay, I'm good. If it wasn't stressful enough trying to avoid death pits, which you can't see that, by the way, but there are death pits, trust me. Uh, I've fallen into them many times. Um, it's not stressful enough. You also like, ah, uh, 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 uh. okay, we're fine. <laughs> uh, you're also just running out of air all the time, so you have to you have to hurry as well. And you can go back where you came from, other thing as well. I am going to just in case grab the extra life there. I don't think we need it, but we should be fine. So we're going to see this big airlock here. It's going to suck out all the egg boxes. And um, if we get sucked out while that's open, then we die. So I'm going to try for this skip here. So I'm going to try... Grab this. Please grab. Three, four... No, grab! No! <laughs> I didn't grab it! Oh, so, oh it's, the, it's, it's the fact that they've made it so evil in this room. Because it's not a... It's not a... Oh, it'll slowly get you. It's such a... No! And out! Like, it's so hard. Yeah, oh, I'm not going to make this. I'm not making this. Maybe I will. Nah, you're fine, you're fine, you're fine. There we go. We oh, should be fine now. Oh, oh. So I, I got a skip here that I'm going to do. Watch this. As soon as that opens, it uh, closes up. I'm going to need a thought. Oh, no! Okay. That normally grabs the third platform and it skips another cycle of the airlock. So it saves like 10 seconds, but we missed it. So which I will not try again because we lose a lot of time to die there. Okay. Sonic, please. please. Oh, it's like so Sonic, please. Nice, grab. nice, nice camera. <laughs> going to take it very slowly. I'm just going to. I'm just going oh, to wait here. Just wait. I'm not, not missing it. <laughs> yeah. See that extra cycle, right? but uh, just that's what I was trying to skip. Quite rightly, I would say, but we, you know, not easy. This should be fine here as long as we get this. Uh, uh, I know, uh, we are, you, yeah. <laughs> 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 How are you alive out of them? Like, you got so know. lucky there. Nice. Oh, man. Then, then this game has your number on this right, man. It's fine, we can make it through here. We'll My back. God, it has your oh. number right now. I'm going to wait until this. I'm just going to. I'm just going to wait. Get out of here. Enemy, go away. Like get <laughs> out the way, please. I don't like them. I don't like those enemies at all. So we have to activate right. this power switch. I don't know if you've seen this power level before, actually. Have you? I, I've done it once, and I okay. said I vowed never to do it again. <laughs> I vowed never to do it again. Yeah. 
So we can hit this uh, bigger switch here, which will will stand far away. I think I think it hurts us. Yeah, uh, it does. Buttons, I think. Okay, okay, good. I'm glad that I'm justified. Okay, but now we are finally back on the, the main route. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Okay. Let's, let's just do this for I I don't want to die oh. anymore. Yeah, nope, no, no, you really don't. You've got three right. You've got three lives as well. You're fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we just save this. Very nice and slowly. Have a nice break after that. So we're going to wait for the lasers. Uh, should we go down? Phew. Nice. And then, on a weird cycle. And then finally, the elevator of safety. Oh, Ori, GG's for doing those rows, but they <laughs> are they are atrocious in a speed run. Jeez. Yeah. That time is actually better than my best for that, for, for going right side, except the other thing is I also died a few times, so it's actually not better. <laughs> it's worse. <laughs> but now we have our favorite race against our favorite hedgehog, Medsonic. Yeah, I love this race a lot. So Black Core here is a race into a boss, into a boss. We're coming up towards the end of the run in about the next six minutes or so. We're going to see Ori just do a lot of precise jumping around here. We're going to jump off the ramp there from the stairs to skip through the lasers here. Managing to get through, get around off the spring, in and round, making sure we dodge the lasers not to get hit by any of them as we keep speeding around, taking an intentional damage boost off the wall to give us the iframes through the rest of the lasers, not having to worry about the cycle before we get into the lava room. Lava room, we're going to jump on the platform. We're going to go up big time. Really? You like this room? Why? No. Nobody likes no. this room. <laughs> oh, oh, don't talk there. Please don't talk there. All right. I so to. I was going to fall. Uh, makes it through. Makes it in. Ori giving us a heart attack as we run in. We're coming to the end of the stage as well. Yeah, All the way thing, around to the end. Uh, one, one thing to know is I'm also trying to jump into these uh, gravity flippers with my jump and not like just walk into them by landing on the edge. Because if I keep my jump, I can actually do my thought as soon as I land to so get a bit more speed after the gravity flips. <sighs> but we do have that that was not bad. I do have yeah. my the boss now. Mm -hmm. Which is Metal Sonic. Uh where are you? So Metal Sonic right now is playing a game of pinball. Basically you have to jump into him. When you see him do that wireframe kind of thing, that means his next hit is vulnerable. <gasps> so we're gonna what? get three hits on him very quickly there. He's gonna take an intentional damage then try and run into Metal Sonic again for another two quick hits. And Ori nailing it there. Now he's going to go into pinball. Yo! Oh, Holy not God. quite. Just missing it. So we're going to have to get an extra phase here. Because okay, after okay. we get this hit, okay. he's going to go into oh. pinball phase. Ori is now going to use Doom Mode just to line up Metal Sonic here. Because Metal Sonic is going to line what? up. And as long as we... <laughs> wow. Uh... As long as we can line Metal Sonic up, we can actually control where he's going to go. But on this phase, Metal Sonic just said no. Uh, so we're gonna no, no. we're gonna try oh, that please. again. Please. Oh please. please. Oh please. I can't hit him. <laughs> oh. oh. I don't have enough speed to get into him. He's just he just staying away from me. No, he was he he, he was coming for you. But he should be around here. Oh, it's yeah. not good. No, no, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. There, we, there go. we go. Get the hit. Okay. okay. Two more hits to go. Waiting for the pinball. Line him up. Nailed it. Oh no! Where, where are you? He bounces more and more every time he just was bounces. Like yes. third we hit. So yes. the first one is easy. That well, the last one here will be hard. Also, there'll be six bounces here. Five, six. I don't know. No, that was five. Oh, okay. I didn't think I would hit, but there we go. All right. I'm going to guess this side of the door. So the door is on one of these sides. It's the direction I'm going to guess it's behind part. you. I'm guessing it's behind you. <laughs> I'm keeping an eye. Oh, no. No, you were right. Hey! <laughs> I'm sad. If I just walked forward, I would have just completely missed that. And now, as you can see, Eggman has still... Oh, what? Did I just... Did I just get the cutscene? Yeah, a little bit. It, it, normally the camera sw swings back to the emeralds there. Anyway, we've got a final boss now, though. We're going to try not to die here. This boss is actually hard. Yeah, and this is Brack. As well. This is Brack. You may know him from the Sonic uh, OVA. And, oh, um, uh, yeah, it has three main attacks that you're going to see. 
Uh, you've got the flamethrower there that drops flames that's persistent and you get damage from. Thank you for showing us, Ori. You've also got the mines there. The mines, if they hit you, they will launch you absolutely massively away. And then there's also the belly bomb that we'll see when we get through into phase number two here. So they've got a shield. The shield is coming back up again. You need to then put the okay. boss through the shield uh, and into the giant red pillar that's going to come down. So here we go, red pillar, green pillar, got to bring down. Oh, Boss oh, being an absolute no, 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 got to no, no, hide. No, 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 no. Nope. I can't hide, there's nowhere to hide. There's nowhere to Thankfully, hide. Thankfully, he decided to walk into the thing by himself, but that's good. It never happens. <laughs> Alright, that's three hits left. Two hits left to go. I'm just taking damage there to not get hit by his rockets. One more hit to go. And that is the final boss done. So timer will be coming up in a bit. As soon as the in-game timer on the bottom stops, timer will be coming up. If you do a big jump, we just get a funny gravity bit there. But time's coming up. Wait for it. It's actually a one cutscene, one gun, I remember. There we go, time. Hey! <laughs> GG's! Oh, thank you, that was, that was, uh... I, I that, that was a fun. <laughs> I did not enjoy having to do Egg Rock 1 and 2 there, but the rest of it was fun. <laughs> it was for a good cause, and you did well was... going through them. Yes, th thank you again to everyone who did donate for the incentive. Uh, I'm, I'm sure everyone enjoyed watching me fail. Uh, but yes, that, that was fun to go. And thank you again for accepting the run into the marathon as well, into Fashion Spurs. I do really appreciate that. It is, this game is very fun. And again, it is free. Um, it's just, if you go to like srb2.org, it is available there, and it is still developing as well, so they are still making more for this game. Um, I think, do you have anything else to say, Agak? No, just GG's, congrats on the run, and uh, well played! Thank you, and thank you again for joining me on commentary as well, I really appreciate that. Uh, thank you for having me.